Welcome to another edition of Carbs. You're in Reckless Eating, the only show where I sit in a car and BS while consuming carbs, a brand new item from El Pollo Loco. But before we go into that, check out our gaming channel, Zion Mainframe Gaming, by clicking the annotation right there or going down in the description for the link. If you like Let's Plays combined with our personalities, that is the gaming channel for you. So this is brand new from El Pollo Loco off their ultimate double chicken menus, the ultimate double chicken enchiladas. This is expensive. This is a full-blown dinner. It's uh, about almost $8 for this. There's uh, three other things too, but this is the one that looked the best to me. Uh, it is a lot of food though, so hopefully it's worth the price. I do like El Pollo Loco on occasion. Uh, it's not something I get all the time, but I will go there every once in a while. Usually uh, I would go there more when I lived by my parents' house because there was one that was around that area. Kind of had to travel to get to this one. So. Here's what it all looks like. You got your two enchiladas. You've got a bunch of crap stacked on it, uh, including chicken, cilantro, some kind of sauce. And then you have a big thing of rice, which I love rice. Uh, I'm gonna try a little bit of the rice first. Maybe combine with some of this enchilada sauce. Pretty good, pretty good. Mexican restaurant quality, which I like. I've always liked El Pollo Loco. I think they do have pretty good quality. Little piece of chicken just to see what's up. Also very good. That would be good on nachos. That's like, that's totally nacho chicken. It's nacho chicken, it's mine! What we came for, the actual enchilada. I know I should be using a knife for this, but I am very slow, mentally handicapped, if you will. All right, there we go. We got a little bit of everything. The ultimate chicken enchiladas from El Pollo Loco, brand spanking new. That's a damn good enchilada. That's really good. Enchilada is one of the things my mom would make a lot growing up. I gotta be in the mood for it. And it's not something I can get all the time. But when I do eat enchiladas, it has to be my mom's or El Pollo Loco. So they're pretty damn good. Chicken quality is great. Rice mixes well with the two enchiladas. And just the enchiladas themselves have a lot of flavor. It's good. It's a lot of, lot of taste going on here. It is a bit pricey. I will say that. Especially just for enchiladas. It's one of the cheaper things you can get at, at restaurants. The chicken is delicious. And I think the chicken really makes up for uh, the price. That's some really solid chicken. Don't have very many complaints about this thing. Just other than the price, really. I, I mean, I have to be in the mood for enchiladas, like I said before, but the rice is solid, enchiladas are really solid. It's just a little expensive. So I would give it a very, very low five. If I'm in the right mood for this, it would be exactly what I would want if I was craving it. That was something I really like. But I wouldn't give it a normal five because like I said, gotta be in the mood for it. And like right now I'm actually not, but it was pretty good. It kind of brought me in the mood sexually. But there you go guys. Uh, they also have three other items on the menu. I'm not sure what they were exactly, but they had lots of gross stuff in it. So I went with this one and I like enchiladas. So I just went with this. What are your thoughts on the ultimate menu, the ultimate chicken menu at El Pollo Loco and just at Pollo Loco in general? What's your favorite thing that you get from there? Let me know in the comments down below. And thank you for joining me for this edition of Carbs here on Reckless Eating. We'll see you next time.